setting up promotional goods modifiers. So let's go in Oracle applications and set up a new modifier based on a promotional goods business scenario we just discussed. So I'm going to minimize this and I will go into Oracle applications and I'm presently in the responsibility Oracle Pricing Manager Global. So I'm going to switch the responsibility and I will go to Oracle Pricing User Global. The idea of going to this user is that we have been using the form's UI interface to define new modifiers and this time I want to use a HTML UI interface to show you the end-to-end -end process of defining a new modifier. So having said that, I'm going to switch the responsibility to Oracle Pricing User Global and hit the OK button and it's going to open a HTML user interface and to define a new promotional course modifier, I will simply navigate from the right hand side to this link called as create promotional list. So I'm going to click on that one and then here I'm going to provide my name of the modifier. So let's say MNG promo and then I'm going to give a number over here and then I will leave the start date as today's date and then I'm going to hit a next button and here I will add a qualifier to say an attribute and I would say that the payment terms must be prepaid okay so look for terms here and then I will choose a value of prepayment here you go and hit the apply button and then hit the next button and review all the details and complete the modifier header and list qualifier information and now it's asking us to add a modifier line so hit the yes button to add a modifier line and then create the button and then hit the button create line to create a new modifier line and within that one make sure you choose a modifier type as promotional goods and leave rest of the defaults as it is and then hit the continue button and within that one let's make sure if everything is okay so modifier level is line which is perfect and pricing phase is list line adjustment which is also fine apply automatically which is also fine and then we'll hit the next button so nothing to be changed out there and then it's asking us for a item which is to be sold so here I'm gonna go back to our business scenario and I will provide this purchase item and look for that item okay now it's been added and then I will simply hit the next button and here let's do one thing we'll say is in between and we're gonna add some quantity over here so let's say from 1 to 10 okay based on item quantity hit the next button and now this is the one wherein you're giving the benefit of providing a free external hard disk drive when someone has purchased the MS Exchange server. So the item for free hard disk is this one. So let's provide that one and choose it. Then provide the unit of measure which is each and look for the right one. So in this case it is this one. Provide the quantity. So the quantity is one and the price list say corporate okay and the list price of this item is 169.99 but it will be free when someone purchases the MS exchange email server okay the adjustment method is new price which is fine and the value which will be applied on the sales order line would be zero because you are giving it as free okay then hit the next button and if you want to add any line qualifiers 
to that modifier line feel free to do so now but at the moment we don't have any line qualifiers to add so i'm going to hit the next button and here you review all the details that you have just added and then simply hit the finish button to make the changes come into effect now i will go back to the modifier and i got to activate it as well so make sure you check this checkbox at the general information or modifier header level so the general information is nothing but your modifier header so make sure you check the checkbox and hit the apply button to save your changes now let's go back and quickly check to make sure this is indeed active so what we have just created is a promotion and now you see that the active status is yes now we need to go into oracle applications and apply this modifier on a sales order testing promotional goods modifier in auto management so let's go into oracle auto management and quickly test our newly set up promotional goods modifier so i'm going to minimize this and i will go into oracle applications within that i will switch the responsibility to oracle auto management super user vision operations usa and hit the ok button now navigate to orders comma returns and then sales orders with that one we'll start by entering the order for a customer called as sona corporation and then we've got to make sure that the payment terms are prepayment so i'm going to change that okay and now you save the record to generate the sales order number so this sales order number is just generated let's save this sales order number in our excel file over here for our reference now at this point i will go back to the business scenario that we have just discussed and using which we have set up our promo modifier so according to our business scenario the customer must purchase item as35 400 which is nothing but ms exchange email server and then they will receive item as41481 which is nothing but 1 terabyte external hard disk drive worth 169.99 free of cost and for that to happen we have set up a modifier of promotional type and then as part of the modifier setup we have also used a qualifier to apply this modifier which is nothing but of the payment type prepayment so we have just chosen the payment type as prepayment and now we will go to line items and then i will enter this particular item i'm going to expand this and then i will enter a quantity let's say 2 so the unit price is 3500 and as soon as i save this the system is going to add a line automatically for the promo that we have just discussed and look at that a new line has been created for item as41481 and for quantity 1 so where has this come from this has come from the modifier that we have just set up in advanced pricing of type promotional goods now if you would like to see the details of this modifier simply go to actions and then scroll down to a function called as view adjustments and hit the ok button and you will be able to see the details of the modifier which just got applied it's of a name of mng promo the one that we have just set up and then you can see the details of the modifier over here okay and if you would like to see more details about the modifier you can see it over here how this modifier got applied what were the qualifiers associated with this modifier and so on so look at that in this case payment terms equals prepayment pause our qualifier which was passed and then it has also passed the item number as this which is the first line and then this items quantity is between 1 and 10 which was one of the qualification criteria we have given so as to qualify for a free discount offer of one terabyte hard disk drive 
So this is how you go and set up your promotional modifier and test it over sales orders.